The second question that I got is, with all the social media that we have today, Facebook, Instagram being strong pre online presences, is it worth still having a website? And the question is, yes, 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 yes. You need a place where you can organize your portfolio. And by organize, I mean organize the way you want. Organize the way you want people to see it. Because Facebook is all right, Instagram is all right, but the organization the, 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 uh, of those tools, the, I mean, you, you have no control over how they display your information, right? I mean, they're going to put your information there, and that's what it is. Now, website, you, you, you have your contact forms. If you want, I, although I don't advise that, but you're going to have uh, pricing, although I do not advise people to put price on website. That's my opinion. Uh, you're going to have who are you, about you, all that good stuff that people are looking. Remember what I just said. Photography is a business of relationships. So you people want to know who you are. Okay? So, yeah, social media is great and you should be feeding social media also. Instagram today, if, you, if, you're, if you're public are made of younger folks, you want to pay more attention to Instagram than Facebook. But you still need to put on Facebook. Because think about this. If you shoot high school seniors, who is paying for the photo shoot? Who is paying for the prints? Who is paying for everything? The parents, not the kids, right? So Instagram to so kids can find you, but Facebook also for the parents. Okay, so you need to have pre presence in, on both platforms. This is how I do it, and that's what works for us. 